And they're old. They're the old twist things. The lethal weapons. So there we go. Mix is almost ready. We just did a uh, three and a half bag to a full. But shite. They just shite. Good. Wednesday, the Wednesday the twentieth, twentieth, the day after the heat wave. Yeah, we didn't turn in for work yesterday, like most sensible people did. We'll give it a miss. I think Alex just uh, melted playing Xbox, and I went pricing jobs, sat in the air-conditioned air car, so it wasn't too bad. So this is today's job. Thanks. Right, wind is already out. Which is always a big help. Now, when you do it bricking a window up, and you obviously do, do away with it, most of the times you can leave the lintel in, which doesn't really matter. But with the cavity, where they've returned the brickwork on the cavity, you've got to take that out so the cavity is continuous. Otherwise, you've got this big break, chance of getting uh, damp through. Obviously, because there's no damp force with it being an old property, so there's a chance of damping track through. And also, you've got your cold bridging, which is a, there's a massive thing about cold bridging now. So, you, you, you damp, not you damp, your cold can track through and straight through into the, across the cavity. So, this is all coming out. It shouldn't be too hard. Most of it's just pieces and it's lime water. So, well, we've got to tighten out if we need be. Yeah. And then, um, the bath is being swapped eventually. The whole house is being swapped around. The steel's going in here. Uh, the room, rooms are being moved. That, 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 straight ahead of me there, you can see the spiral staircase. That's the wall we blocked up the other day. Uh, it might be in the same video, I'm not sure yet. And then uh, the front door is being moved. Um, can't remember where to. Um, yeah, I think. I think it's been moved over. It's staying in the same position but moved over slightly to make to make I'm waffling now. There's a lot of remodelling going on anyway. So it's a big job. We've got a few little jobs to do. I'm just popping back as a forwards. So yeah this is today's project. So first thing is strip all the cavity out and then um, get ready to block up. We're using seven newton block concrete. Everyone's doing the year, uh, the, the uh, breeze block challenge. Don't know how we're doing that. <coughs> yeah, anyway, yeah, blocking up. There's a steel going across here eventually, so we're just going to block it up. And then when we come to that, we're going to take the lintel out and cut down and put a pad stone in. We don't know any positions yet, so let's just get it sealed up for now. <coughs> and then you can have the bathroom back. So, yeah, um, we'll catch you in a bit. There we have it, mix is almost ready. We just did three and a half bags of sand to one cement, so because we don't want to risk running out of water, which we always seem to do. But all I've been doing now, Dad's been freeing up some uh, some of the rendering. Is this so we can get a line up, or? Oh, just we can uh, range in on the brickwork. Oh, okay. So we can range into the brickwork. So, and I think we've just done a bit of measuring. The inside wall will work, work block tight, but the front. Might just have to need a bit, a few cuts, so we'll have to whack out the uh, still saw for that. But progress. I'll uh, just give that a bit more of a wet up, and then we'll be ready. So catch you in a bit. Well, uh, that was easier than you thought, wasn't it? Yes. You snapped off nice and easy then. Because they're splits. Yeah. Not full bricks. So you can see there, so they just snapped on the first hit. So that's this uh, Good post. poster though. Yeah, thank you, Roughneck. Good, good, good gear, that. But yeah, so obviously that part is exposed there, and then you just have to get all up there, like Dad said. So, 
I'll just uh, stick back into the envelopes and not much else to say. This, we'll take this out and just review it. Yeah. That's just to catch all the crap. <clears throat> well, we've got plenty of that roll, so. Yeah. There's another tie wire there, look. Made some progress. Yeah, you can talk because I've got the thing on. Yeah. So, as you can see, that cavity is all cleared up. And uh, I've lost some touch. I've not uh, not filmed a video for work in ages. <laughs> but um, yeah, so all that crap's out. I made a start on this side, but um, just because of how tight it was, I let Dad finish off first. But this has going to be a bit more faffy because it's bonded in, whereas Dad's was all just um, like that. just he's just slotted in but shite they're just shite but anyway so that's uh, almost halfway there so we'll get that knocked out have a quick break and then um, get ourselves ready I've made one, one other quick point while you're in this position and you're doing this just go in there and get all the crap out snots and bits and bobs and just get it out while you can because it, once it's bricked up that's, you, you, your opportunities are gone but if you go up there, I'll, the, the, the tie wires are in absolutely perfect condition. Yeah. Not a sign of rust on them, which is great. I think probably because it's rendered, it's a bit sheltered, but but they're in great nick then. That's good. There's no sign of them rusting, and they're old. They're the old twist things, the lethal weapons. Yeah, so um, I'll swap sides and then we'll go for a brew. Sounds good. Uh, I'll use you as a template now. This one. Yeah, definitely cuts like it. Got the tub out.
Ah, I like it. <clears throat> Let's push that over. Thank you. Okay, well. I can't wait to make one cracking in the dark. Out, sorry, the buns. Yeah.
Pardon? Yeah, yeah. Ah. Chop point, anyway. Chop point, Joe. Yeah. I'll stomp on you. Three kicks. Was it? I think so. Thank you. We'll be a little face the camera and we can go for a break. Uh, so there you have it. <coughs> That's both sides completely cut out and emptied out so next phase will be get all that cleaned up and then maybe get some block work in I think um, we're going to try and get some of the hop ups at first but we brought the scaffold to get the rest of it in and obviously we're going to go at it a course at a time on both sides so see you after break
There we have it. Let's play that half one. Then same old thing, look straightforward, quite fiddly. Cuts, all these cuts. Um, <clears throat> yeah, we cut the cavity out as we showed you, so it's a proper job. Insulation runs right through now to the existing blown in. Same with this side, so it runs right through. I've also pushed it up inside the lintels as well. Uh, there is no lintel here, that's just got like a, an angle bead on that, you see the rust. But this is all getting re redone, re k rendered after. Inside there's a timber lintel, it might be in the way of not. It might be in the way, it might not. Whatever happens, there's a pad stone going on the other side at, at, at some time. So we'll probably just drill it, stitch drill it, and stick the pad stone in, ready for the steel to go in. But like, that's another job for another day. So, um, just a bit of a tap, well, a load of tidying up for you, which is all looks really good. I'm just going to go inside and give this a tidy up, so I'll take you in with me, and then I'll do a quick outro from the inside. There you have it, quick, quick inside view. inside now. Not as warm as the last two days, but still very warm. Um, I'm going to do that sort of clean. Yeah, I'm going to do some good clean out now. I'll just sort the outside out and then we're away. Another job done. One two little jobs in here. We'll take them one job at a time. I'll give you a quick look at it. One day's job. This one day's job. So there is a steel going from around here somewhere. Onto that wall, that's why I've done it in um, seven newton block. So we'll fettle with that when we get to it. So I'll hand you over to Alex. There he is, there's Alex. <laughs> He's the outro when he composes himself. So, that's another project knocked out, piece by piece, now. And so, that's another job knocked out of the park, nice and easy, well, relatively. But anyway, if you enjoyed watching this, be sure to give it a thumbs up, it's massively appreciated. And if you're new to the channel, or you want to see more, be sure to hit subscribe and tap on that bell, so you're notified whenever we upload. Again, we greatly appreciate all of that, it's a massive help for the channel. This has been Brooklyn with Steve and Alex. With a bricked up window, blocked up window, even. And we'll see you in the next video.